The Boeing XF-8B was developed by Boeing during World War II. It was a single-engine aircraft developed to provide the U.S. Navy with a long-range shipboard fighter aircraft, and it was intended for operation against the Japanese home islands. Boeing saw the XF-8B-1 as a 5-in-1 fighter, that would be capable of serving as a fighter, interceptor, dive bomber, torpedo bomber or level bomber. It was powered by a Pratt & Whitney XR-43-6010 radial engine, and had two three-bladed contra-rotating propellers. At the time it was developed, it was the largest single-seat piston fighter ever used in the U.S. A contract was made for three prototypes, in May 1943. However when the war ended in 1945, only one had been completed. The first prototype made its first flight in November 1944, and the two remaining prototypes were completed after the end of the war. The wings of the XF-8B were large, and could fold vertically. The aircraft had an internal bomb bay, and large fuel tanks. Even more fuel could be carried in external tanks. The armament plan for the aircraft was 6.5-inch machine guns or 620mm wing-mounted cannons. It was to be able to carry a 6,400-pound bomb load or two 2,000-pound torpedoes. The second and third prototypes were fitted with a second seat to allow a flight engineer to monitor the test flights. Testing went on until 1947, but the end of the war had changed U.S. strategy. The new strategy required Boeing to concentrate on large land-based bombers and transports. Also, jet fighters were becoming the new focus, making piston-engined aircraft obsolete. The U.S. Navy offered Boeing a small contract, but Boeing chose to shut down the XF-8B program. After the program ended, all three prototypes were scrapped.